What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and today we have a lot to cover. Now I know I've been absent for quite a long time now. I've been doing some really crazy shit with managing my streams and managing the new format of my videos. Once again, I gotta apologize for the absence. I know everyone's saying that you've heard this a million times before, but your boy really does. Like, like look, I got some fucking crazy ass hand pad thing. This thing is supposed to be able to control the live streams from now on and the kinds of format of videos that I have from now on. So I'm hoping it'll be able to do that job the way I need it to. I need to take a few days to configure that bitch, but now that it's perfectly configured, we are in a good position. Anyways, there's a lot of stuff for us to cover. Now, the biggest thing being that Custom Amiibo has finally finished their Red Robin, and it, it, it looks damn good, man. Let's head over to the, um, to the actual news thing right now so you can see what I'm talking about here. So we're on Custom Amiibo's page right now, and if you don't know who these guys are, they're basically the dudes who said that they were going to be able to create a custom Red Robin for me back when I discovered them in February. And in February of this year, I saw the work that they did, and I was like, you know what, it's impressive, but let's see if these guys can really do something serious. And by good God almighty, they've done serious stuff before, and this one definitely lies with them all. We're here at their page right now, and as you can see, challenge complete. I'm a big fan of Natural Light, thanks all for sharing with Etika, the hype was strong. And as you guys know with your boy here, hype is definitely on deck. The Red Robin looks clean. I like the way that the uh, hair actually lays along the garment, the way that it does in Smash Brothers as well too. Notice that detail from the moment I saw this thing, very very nice. Oh, let me just make sure my thing is good, yeah yeah it's good. But um, very nice attention to detail there. And on top of everything else, man, like, like just, you know, the fact that they chose, like, kind of like a glossy finish for the jacket looks really cool as well, too. There's a little bit of an issue with the hand there has, like, some black paint on it. Doesn't really look that attractive, but I mean, you know, I mean, hey, it, it's close enough to look exactly kind of like Red Robin. And, you know, this is really good. They have the hair part really well, too. And the hair, it, it's done good, man. Like, I haven't seen, I've seen other Red Robin that were floating around the internet as well, too. A lot of you guys showed me the other Robins that were around. And... Man, you know, this one is definitely different. I like how all of them kind of take a little bit of a different stance. I was a little bit worried that the Red Robin would come out looking like a dude with a wig. But this one, this one does not. Like, this one definitely looks more accurate than the other ones do. You know, there's always room for improvement when it comes to these things. But Custom Amiibo, I think that they've done a lot of um, Amiibo lines where they just kind of like keep trying the same style over and over again and they steadily get better at it because they had like a couple of revisions of other ones and they came out great too and you know this Red Robin is a damn good start considering this is their first Red Robin I'm happy that this one is done and these guys are really going to send it to me and everything I am so honored man custom amiibo man I gotta give these dudes a shout out they their, their stand up work was the first thing that made me notice them and to be honest with you guys like they still do a lot of great work nowadays they have a lot of orders so it's hard to kind of like I guess keep up with the demand but they got customers man and that's one thing that you can be happy about there's some other pictures as well as well of this thing let me see here actually cuz on their Instagram is where they really show off like like the pretty angles and whatnot so if we go to the Instagram right here there we go so we can see more details of it um, here's just like a full-on body shot. Like I said, the um, the jacket is glossy paint finished, so it looks really clean. Um, and then we have like this closer angle, I suppose. But the hand definitely doesn't look too normal. But I mean, it's all good, man. It's all good. This is great for a first attempt. Um, the hair, like I said, the fact that it lays along her clothing, definitely a nice look. Um, here's another one as well too. Really shows off the gloss. You can see the back of the hair. And they got the details really nicely with the hair. Like, I didn't notice this before, actually. But looking closer now, the hair is just... Re it has all the lines and the proper parting. The way that Robin usually has her pigtails. Like, really nice attention to detail there. And they even got the part right. Like, it wasn't just like a full bang. It was actually like a part. It wasn't a bang, you know? So it looks really good on this Amiibo. And then the angle that we saw in their um, Twitter post... This thing looks sexy, man, and once I get this thing in the mail, you best believe guaranteed on your nutsack, your boy is definitely going to be covering this thing. I'll be, you know, showing you some angles on my own, and, you know, we'll just really get into how awesome this Red Robin is. I cannot believe Red Robin is going to be able to chill on my table. I, this is an amazing piece of work, man. You guys definitely deserve kudos, and there are other people out there who are making their Robin female amiibo as well, too. Yo, everyone deserves props in this thing. I know Ganda Chris, she did one of her own. Really cool stuff, man. So, 
Once again, guys, if you need to get some custom amiibo work done, I can definitely recommend you to these guys. Their orders are a little bit, you know, backed up, but I mean, they're, they're, they're doing their best to keep up with everybody. They delayed my Red Robin for so long because they were trying to keep up with their other customers' orders who were placed before mine. So, I mean, it's totally understandable. And by all means, man, this is the place to go if you want to get your custom amiibo. I can guarantee you that. I will talk to you guys in the next video. And once again, links to all this stuff will be in the description. Take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.